Good morning everybody, how are we all doing? It is Monday and I'm just getting ready to go to Olivia's ADHD assessment in town. I'm not driving there today, I'm going to get the bus because it's all changed one way systems in the town centre and excuse me if you can hear the animals, they're being greedy because I've got a caramel slice here and the dog is after it. So yeah, it's all one way system at the minute and all the road work, so I thought I'll just get the bus, it's easier. Get down! Anyway guys, I'll catch up with you a bit. I guess I'm back from um, Olivia's appointment. <sighs> oh my god, that was so st <sighs> well. It wasn't stressful but in the sense I I didn't go in, so I just let Olivia go into her appointment. Told them to be truthful and honest and how she feels and you know how she is inside and stuff. Oh, just let's let the cat out. Anyway, so back home with the cuppa first. <laughs> Can't beat a brew. Um, the paperwork I had to fill out because I'm not great with paperwork and trying to word things with the very little space that you have. So they'll give you a question now. It were three pieces of paper full of questions, and so it'll be number one, blah 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 blah, and then you just get that much space. I'm like, how the heck am I meant to write everything down that I need to say? And, and then when you hold the pen so hard, that bit of your finger stick, digs in. So now my thing, my hand's killing me because of the pain. Uh, with holding the pen for so long, I had to keep stopping and starting. And time I not even finished my paperwork, Olivia were out, and it was within an hour. <laughs> not even an hour actually, because it wouldn't have taken me that long to write. Anyway, um, the most stressful bit was. Uh, the bus dr drive there on the bus that I got from near my house because I want driving because the city centre at the minute where I am is getting turned into what looks like the one-way system like Leeds and some of the roads are closed and some of the roads that I need would need to drive down is closed and one that I would need to drive at home it's closed on that side as well so I'll be like how the hell do you get round it and I'm not great with roundabouts I'm, I'm stuck like this because my back is kind of locked a little bit <laughs> and hurting um, oh, I forgot what I was saying now and yeah so I decided to get the bus and I, and I did say to Olivia next time <sighs> when my mind was in Okay, place I've finished. And I went down a different way. I thought I could have easily just parked in there and then just walked up. But then thinking about it, I thought, oh, I would have got all out of there because it's a one way system. So you need to drive the long way around to get home. And I'm like, nah, you know what it is? I'll just get the bus. And I did a few YouTube shots and um. I'm going to do another one in a minute. I'm going to tell you what it is, but it's hilarious. I got it thinking it'd fit one of the animals, but it didn't. <laughs> so it's more likely it's going to fit the kittens. The kitten, should I say. Um, uh, so, yeah. I did one. You know, when you, as a kid, you used to get on the double-decker bus and you used to get excited if you could go up the up to top deck and sit right at the front with the big window so you sat and you look like you're like wee but as a kid the buses were obviously before they got modernized they used to have a glassing above the driver's head so i think the 
I obviously like I think the driver could look up and it did a mirror so you could see the rest of the bus before cameras got fitted and stuff. And I remember like and you know tapping on it and the driver look up and you yeah, <laughs> as a kid. So that just brought back like that kind of memory. But then after I did that stresses of not knowing where the bus were going, I'm like, eh? I don't remember the bus going this way, I don't remember going that way, and I'm like, this one-way system is just messing, well, messing with my head. So, yeah, <laughs> and it's very rare that I go into town anyway. Sorry, Olivia came in. Um, so, uh, yeah, so it's all changed to one-way system. Uh, I don't like it. It's it's getting like Leeds, and I want, I refuse to drive to Leeds anywhere with a massive roundabout, idiot drivers. Uh, I like to stick to roads and all. I like to stick with routes and all. And if I get thrown off guard, I don't, I don't, my mind just goes into a meltdown. Also, other fibro, I won't say sufferers, but warriors. But, um, I'll be back. Um, do you ever... Let me know in the comments below because I've got one patch on my leg. Um, you can't you can't see anything like red, bruised, or cut or anything. And I get I get it with the feet, and I understand that because I've seen that in one of the symptoms. But I've got a patch on my leg. Like I said, it's not there. It's just plain soft skin, but it's burning. And it's it's like a burning feel like I've got a scratch there, but there's nothing there. It comes and goes and it's like a like a hot spot type thing, like they're really burning and it, it and it's noticeable. I can I'm like, ow, oh, you know, that really is uncomfortable. But yeah, let me know if you suffer with that because <laughs> Yeah. How oh, did you all have a good? Did you all have a good day yesterday with Mother's Day? Did you get anything nice? Did you get some cards? Yeah, I I, I, I want to do that clip like I saw off TikTok, but I can't get myself into that. This guy, it's, he's too funny. I don't think I could compete to it. Where he texts me cat and mothers when they're in the kitchen. I think I said it yesterday. Where he texts me cat and mothers when you're in the you're in the kitchen on your own and you start. Mm, okay, let's just put this cup here. Don't put that cup away. Don't put the dishes away. I'll do all the washing up. So funny. Oh, I can't even. I don't think I could even be good, <laughs> any good at that. Anyway, guys, so that's it really for today. I'm gonna for the rest, the remainder of the afternoon and evening. I I honestly feel like I need to go and have a lie down. And reason being is that Tom went out with his mates last night and left a dog, his his dog who is very clingy. Um, and you leave the room and she's barking. She's not barking now because he's asleep on set A. Um. I'm not even going to move him because he's in the mood earlier. But I went to get Olivia to settle down and I started nodding off and I left Millie in the living room thinking, oh, and I left the TV on thinking when Tom comes in, he'll just turn it all off and it gives us something for the dogs. Now, I think after a bit, they realised I wasn't coming back through. Millie barked. I went in, told her to be quiet. And then... I went back to bed, just as I nodded and she barked again, as I went in, I told her to be quiet. And that happened again afterwards, but then I, I, and then she snuck out and ran into Hannah's room and then Raina started barking, but it's not just one little bark, it's <laughs> So I ended up having to go to sleep on the two-seater. And then I was, Olivia woke up wondering where I was because I, I fell asleep on her bed. And, uh, yeah, ended up. Stayed in the front room till Tom came in till one o'clock in the morning and then I couldn't sleep then. I up and down and then it comes seven o'clock and I didn't want to get up. I'm like, can I rearrange this appointment? I thought, no, he, he, he'd been waiting for this. <laughs> She's been waiting for this point for so long. Anyway, guys, and next we are getting an autism one through the post. I've done my part for the autism. It's just Olivia's sat part. But I'm going to go and... 
have a nap I think on the bed and see where I go from there so thanks again for watching guys <laughs> this is what I got I got three of these and I was gonna put it on the cat's paws but the cat's paws are too big so I'm gonna try the kitten <laughs> and have a bit of fun with that anyway guys i'll catch up with you in the next video don't forget to hit that like button please and subscribe if you're new to this channel and i'll catch up and the notification bell and i'll catch up with you in the next video see you later guys